I've talked about this in a few videos before, and uh, I just want to touch on it quickly. Just I've seen a lot of it happen in the last few weeks, months. It just seems to be a trend, and I don't know if it's a generational thing or, or what. But there seems to be people more and more who are kind of falling in love with their own legacy and uh, starting to buy into the belief that people are going to respect them just because they can perform something well and it excuses the way that they present themselves. It, I, I've talked about it in a video once before where I said if, if I'm having a conversation with someone for the first time and they can't help but tell me how great they are and are constantly pushing that as if I'm supposed to be impressed by it, it's a real turnoff for me as far as any kind of relationship with this person, friendship, or just even knowing them. It, it, it's tiring to hear someone talk about how great they think they are. And honestly, I will always be more impressed by someone who is bad at something and gets better by working hard than someone who starts and has a quote-unquote bright future and a lot of potential because until that potential is realized it's just potential and it doesn't mean or stand for anything so uh, I guess bottom line you're measured by your actions um, not necessarily your intentions and it's always better to be seen as humble than arrogant in my opinion um, as for my birthday this last weekend uh, this session was the night before and I do want to say a big thank you to everybody who uh, who talked to me or commented to me or just dropped even, you know, that extra two seconds of your day to uh, wish me a happy birthday or just hope that my day was going well. Just knowing that people were thinking about that really meant a lot to me and I appreciate it greatly. So thank you all for that. Um, this workout itself, I did that triple on the 640 because the first rep was so bad. It wasn't in my programming to do that, but I just needed to get that first rep back because I messed it up so horribly. Uh, the benching was a very small snapshot of all the benching I did. I just was tired of recording. I went uh, 5, 4, 3, 3, 2, 2, 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, 3, 3, 4, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, all the way up and down. And uh, just a lot of volume in that day. And then the next day was my birthday, and I had a really crazy squat workout. That'll be coming up in the next couple of days. I'm trying to catch up on those videos. But I just had a great birthday, and uh, I am so thankful for all of your guys' support. So I hope you enjoy the video, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.